Hey YouTube, this is a fuse box for a T2 VW bus and this box sits behind that air casing right there, so it fits behind there. And the way to work on this box is to pull it out into the open so that you can check all the fuses, check the relays, and service the panel. Now, the first lessons learned about surfacing this box is to disconnect the positive terminal of the battery so you don't get shot. Number two, this box <clears throat> is likely going to be 40, 50 plus years old. You have to be very gentle with it. You cannot manhandle it and that's a lesson that I learned the hard way. Also another pointer is when you're servicing the box, you're gonna get these clips. See those clips there? Anyway, I broke one off. And the best solution to replace a clip or a secondary clip is to piggyback on an existing clip. So for example, there is a extra clip here. And if I want to get two wires into that single clip, what I can do is go to AutoZone or an auto parts store, and they have these three options. You can get a, two, a one to two clip. So this one goes here. This one is another option. And then this one is the one that I will be using is to clip this on the existing clip. And then now you have two piggyback. So this is a really nice solution. If you happen to manhandle one of the, um, clip and now you can get two back. The third lesson I learned is that it's not necessary to take the dash out because you think that hey I'm going to take the dash out and I can access the fuse panel from above and yes it's true you can see from the above but as you can see Trying to get your hands in here is a tall task and you won't be able to reach the fuse panel to do anything substantial. The other thing is that if you really want to take this thing out and access the back, you have to take your steering wheel out. So the best thing is to pull the panel as I showed you earlier and work it from underneath. Okay, you don't need to access it from the top. Leave the top as is because um, the more you take out, the more you have to put back. Be gentle with these things and uh, best of luck to you.